Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I literally just finished my last vlog in almost this exact same position. So if you haven't seen that one yet, it'll be linked in the description box for you. For today's vlog, we're just doing a regular vlog. This is probably gonna be over a couple of days because I have like a couple of things I wanna like accomplish that I can't do all at once. But we're gonna have some fun like organizing some stuff. I got some stuff from Amazon. We're gonna put something together. Um, I talked a little bit in my last video about how we are finally getting settled here um, and getting organized and getting back into our routine and how badly I needed to get into my routine. And oh my god, do I ever. So if you don't know, for the past month or so we were living at Chris's parents' house. I basically changed my entire life overnight, had a completely new routine. I started skipping breakfast every single day just because I didn't feel like having breakfast. Um, I just was like, did not have the appetite or the desire for breakfast, so I wasn't doing that. I was barely exercising. I was just in an entirely new routine. We ate out a lot just because of we were seeing people that we hadn't seen in a really long time and we went out and like sat outside on the patio somewhere. A lot of dessert that I never usually eat <laughs> at nighttime. Um, I stopped taking my vitamins because I stopped eating breakfast. Just was not feeding myself. I was never getting enough water in. It just was not a good situation. And I took the last week to get settled and not really just like think about anything. But this week I am back in full force. Uh, Sunday. Since Sunday night, today is Wednesday, since Sunday night, my abdomen is completely numb. Um, so that's fun. It's not completely numb, but like pretty close. Like I can tell like if my hand's cold, um, I can feel kind of like if I scratch. Um, it's just a very strange feeling. Also like my back left side is kind of numb as well. And then I just have weird sensation on my body, like on my legs when I was moisturizing. My body just doesn't feel normal. I feel totally fine. It's just like my skin, like if that makes sense. So I waited like 48 hours. I my doctor. I had somebody reach out to me today. I had like an MS nurse reach out to me today and just talk to me about it. Um, and then she's going to pass it on to the doctor. But basically it seems like what's happening in this situation is that it's not an MS relapse, which is really good news. Um, but it's just kind of my life now. <laughs> like it, apparently like this kind of stuff like numbness especially it's just kind of like normal and just like comes and goes maybe doesn't go kind of thing like you just never really know what's gonna happen and a lot of the times it can come out in like stressful situations or like when you change up like your habits and your routines she said on the phone like traveling moving which I just did um, and like even things like camping like not sleeping in your own bed and being like totally out of your routine can put stress on the body which can cause like some kind of like exacerbation um so that's really fun for me i've been doing really really well for quite a while the worst thing that has happened recently is that i had these two fingertips were numb um but I, that was like very, right after the vaccine so i'm thinking maybe the vaccine like just added a little bit of stress to my body and just made them a little bit numb but apparently the numbness doesn't cause any damage um and there's like nothing going on in my brain there's like no neurological issues it's just my life now apparently so that's really fun i'm just very grateful that like it's just uncomfortable feeling mainly when i touch it when i'm just like standing up it kind of feels like i'm wearing like a waist trainer um something is like wrapped around like my belly and i like feel tight like you know after like like an ab workout and you feel like tight and you're like where's my abs and then they're out there but you know what i mean um so it's just like feels like that right now it's fine, it's bearable. I'm grateful that it's not like debilitating and I can just like go on with my life and I'm fine. But it is uncomfortable and it is weird. But with that being said, I'm getting back on my ship because I wanna be healthy. I don't want this stuff to happen to me as much as I personally can prevent it on my own. I will try. Um, so, had my vitamins every day this week. I've worked out twice this week so far. I'm having the best time. I've got a new workout program. It's like this dance workout program. It's really fun. I'll let you know how it goes. Um, keeping my space nice and clean and tidy, eating all of our meals at home, eating breakfast again, having some snacks when I'm hungry, um, drinking, trying so hard to drink more water. I'm gonna check in with you later today if I finally got my three liters, which it's been like almost, it's been over a month and a half since I've had three liters of water in a day and I really need to get back to that. Uh, but I just rambled a whole lot. Let's let's get into the fun stuff that we were gonna do today. Just thought I would give you a little bit of like an update on my MS. Most of the time I'm fine right now, Feel weird, but I'm fine. <laughs> Yesterday, I was just using this as a tripod. Oh my God, I'm an official vlogger. Call me Alicia Marie. <laughs> 
Um, we went to Bed Bath & Beyond. I bought this pot in the 12 quart size and I tried to use it last week. It is way too big. It used way too much water and took too, way too long to boil so I returned it and got the smaller one. This is the 8 quart one. I'm going to use this tonight and hopefully that's a much better solution for us. I was just showing the last vlog. We got a new bath mat today. This is so cute. It's so soft. And I'm very excited. We've just been using a towel on the ground. Got one of these outlets for, let's go put that in the wall. What else we're doing today? I got some shoe storage for our shoe closet. We're gonna deal with that. So I got these like door organizer ones um, for like some smaller shoes and like for mine. Oh, let's put this together and see how that goes. Let's open this up and see like if I need any like screws or anything or tools before I sit down. I think I need a screwdriver. comments talked about how these are kind of like tented but it's not that big of a deal so first we're gonna get out And then there's still so much space down here where we're gonna, I think, put a boot tray there so that we can keep winter boots in here and then we can keep stuff off of here. Over here, I got this big mat from Canadian Tire. It was like less than 20 bucks. I don't wanna keep shoes here. Over here, I'm gonna end up putting like a cute little table of some sort with like a big mirror and I just don't wanna see my shoes and crap everywhere. Next, I've got these Cool. Okay, so one is there. They've got these cute little hooks at the top. Um, it doesn't look like two are gonna fit there. So I think I will have to put the other one probably in the laundry closet. Cool. Okay, let's put some shoes away. So to go and magic erase the walls because these walls, oh, they're the worst. <laughs> Here it is. This is the situation for right now. So that's all of Chris's shoes on his rack. And then our winter boots, like I said, that'll be a boot tray. And then here is mine, my most worn shoes. And then here's some shoes. I don't wear much anymore, um, but we'll still wear them eventually. It's working out. Then there was another thing I wanted to film today. I was gonna use these bins and organize this cupboard. I was gonna go through this whole bin um, and fill those and like organize it and like um, like reorganize this drawer, get stuff in here. Um, but the thing is, we have somebody coming um, this week. He's gonna take this face off of this drawer so that we can use this drawer. Um, while we're waiting for our replacement face. So I'm gonna have to do that probably another day this All week. All right guys, it's the next day. I'm sitting on the floor of my bathroom. Can we just talk for a second about how good the lighting is in here? Um, so I told you guys that I was just waiting for the maintenance people to come and change the face of our drawer um, because it was like really floppy. Well, they actually ended up coming and just giving us a whole new drawer. So that is finally fixed, thank God. And then we also have our tall cabinet, um, which I bought these organizers for, um, that is just like sitting empty right now. We've got this bin over here uh, with a bunch of stuff in it. And then our bottom drawer of our cabinet has a bunch of stuff in it too. Today I'm gonna sit and I'm gonna organize and try to find a place for everything so we can get this bin out of the bathroom. Let me show you my current situation. So right now, I've still got, this is my bag that I used like when we were at Chris's parents' house, so the majority of my stuff's in here, but I hate it all being down here. And then just obviously a bunch of other like random stuff. And then we also have this bin of a bunch of stuff, like I think this is all like nail polish and just an assortment of things. Um, so I'm gonna try to go through all of this and try to find a place for it today. I also have it up there. So I think what I'm gonna do is just kinda like point this down at the ground and just kinda show you 
But the main idea is, I guess. So I already know that one of these I want to be like day skincare. And one of them I want to be like night skincare. Unless, oh, okay, that fits kind of well if it like lays like this. So, um, so let, let me, let me go through all of this. So this container here, doing the best I can, is my got like hyaluronic acid, vitamin C, um, eye cream, that's my morning stuff. Um, then my nighttime stuff, just a bunch of like eye cream, moisturizer, um, this is a, an oil, some acids, that kind of thing. Okay, this is what I've got for now. This is Chris's. I'm gonna put it closer to the top because I can't reach. <laughs> so that can be for Chris. But this is just like face mask stuff right in there. This is just some like random stuff I'm still figuring out a purpose for. There. My cleansers. Day. Time. Here. And uh, night time. Here. <laughs> okay, new plan. I succeeded in getting the one bin off the ground. So now we just have this bin, which is just all of our towels. Um, but like I said, we are getting something that's going to be going here that's going to be holding all of our folded towels and probably. Um, maybe some other stuff. This organization stuff is probably going to change um, in a couple of weeks once we finally get the thing for the bathroom. Um, but right now we just got like mouthwash because it's the only cupboard that could hold it. Back there is like some of my travel container or travel bags, um, sunscreen and stuff and more like travel bags. This bottom one's kind of a disaster right now, but I've got this bin that's got a bunch of like my random stuff, like I got some scrubs, a bunch of body lotions. This is too tall, so it has to lay down. It's like my hair color stuff. These are some bags of like, these are, I have a bunch of little like sample size things and travel size things, um, and then my nail polishes and stuff, and then this is Chris's stuff. Then up here for now, this is kind of just like overflow stuff that I'm gonna organize again once we have the new thing in here. Um, it's just some random stuff, more random stuff. This is mainly like our toothbrushes, and stuff we're using this just I don't know where to put it right now um, and then some more any of our like overflow so we've got like a bunch of extra toothpaste a bunch of travel toothpaste flossers flosses toothbrushes more mouthwash stuff so that is the update for the bathroom for now and in a couple of weeks when we do get the like bathroom unit in here and put the towels and all that kind of stuff in it I'll finally be able to show you what everything looks like but I think that it's going to be it for today's vlog we did a bunch of organizational things the apartment's starting to really come together I do still want to move some stuff around we still have a couple of things to get um, and then it's gonna be like decorating time I want to wait for the decorating until I know what my space really looks like so definitely stay tuned for that and thank you so much for watching. I really hope you're enjoying the apartment series so far. I really am. It's been a lot of fun to have you along with me. Um, and yeah, so thanks for being here and I hope to see you back here for my next video. Bye.